ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, we are back, and I have cleared out all the robots in this part of town. So let's check out Pelican Bay. I mean, I'm sure Aunt Claire would like to see what we found in the form of that giant ah, The Pelican Bay Boardwalk. Fun, games, also murder and dark magic. Heck yeah. Bring the kids. Fun times will be had by all. The giant gear leaning against the wall? Jank here. As you approach, the waxen man comes to life. You, sir, that is to say, you, sir. Indeed, I singled you out the first moment. I sensed it immediately. You sensed something? What did you sense? Is it not clear? Is it not apparent? This man thirsts for values, craves the body and soul. He's right. Wow. Fate has brought us together, friend. Love is our destiny. What is your deal? Who are you? I'm Curtis Swindle, reputable vendor. I saw the Pelican Bay attendant. I am the attendant as well as the gift shop owner. I operate the ticket booth and concessions. Everything, really. I'm it. You should know that we are Pelican Bay only... Bleh, expect, ex, bleh, we are Pelican Bay except the only form of currency here worth anything around here. Robux? No, we only accept tokens. Boardwalk tokens, obviously. Tokens? Where am I supposed to get them? You have the same way everybody does. Only way you can. Trying your hand at thrilling games of skill running behind this gate. Why don't you use cash? Well, I suppose I have my own purposes for them, but uh, in here on the walk, everyone gives them to her. No one moves without her say so. You say her, what do you mean? Ah, you'll find out soon enough. Just let us in. Of course, let me see a ticket. I assume we purchased those from you? Why would you assume something like that? Well, a lot of tickets, like, it's like you're standing in a ticket booth. Please, sir, lower your voice. But I... Ah, sir, Curtis Swindle, also acts as security for the boardwalk. We are licensed to sodomize unruly visitors. That's horrible. I, I don't think I would like that. Well, perhaps you'll mind your town. You want to listen why? You take it. If you find the ticket, which is impossible, I might let you in. Maybe. Well then. Why, sorry, you're drawn to my bargains like a moth to a bargain. Sorry about that. I was distracted. Well then, we better head to Ian Claire's room again. Can't really go to the boardwalk. I feel a wee bit cheated. I thought I would get to explore more, but once again, the game goes, Nope! You go where I tell you, when I tell you. You get no free roaming. I'll give you the illusion of free roaming, but that's about it. Another successful expedition, I hope. I hardly know where to begin. We found this winding key. A winding key it would indeed be strange. It would imply that, beyond every other odd feature, that machine is spring-driven in some way. Quaint! Why would they still need this thing? Why would they, wouldn't they still need this thing? Why would they leave it lying around? Uh, perhaps the key is only need required during the activation phase. That or perhaps it's no longer necessary. Maybe our mysterious inventor perfected a new power source. I have parts to upgrade. Heck yeah. Work your magic. No magic, I'm afraid. That's me uncle's area of expertise. Hopefully science will suffice. Do you think do with this rake? Yes, absolutely. I'm gonna have the maid take it to the street with the other garbage. I shall do my best. Slightly better rake. More powerful than the original rake, but you know, still pretty much just a rake. Alright, back to rake. Pelican Bay. But I tried going to Pelican Bay, they wouldn't let me in. They don't like me. I'm going to change the difficulty. Wow, I have not found all the parts there. Alright. I have found nothing like all the parts in Hobo Alley. to visit the crap hole. Wouldn't let me in before. Didn't need it. Wasted time. Your time and mine. I'm very sorry. Wasted time. Uh, sitting on the dock of the bee. 
watching the tide. Ah, oh, it's still locked. But I was told to go here. What do you want from me? Lightning juice? Okay, I'll speed up when I can. Hold on, I'm gonna pause it. Okay, and we're back, and I figured out I gotta talk to this guy again. That's what I was doing wrong. I didn't talk to the guy again. Hey, you gotta help me! We do? Well, it would be nice. Help you with what? I'm James Filth. I collect trash. That's great, James. Good to have a hobby. I'll keep it. It's not for me. I'm a garbage man. Anyway, just listen to my damn story. Tell me your troubles, trashmonger. So I reached down lovingly, tenderly to pick up the morning's garbage, and it bit me. Who? What? The trash itself, and not some rodent or savage hobo? Are you, you heard right. It said my mom was... Well, it said something mean about my mom. Garbage was rude? Okay. Living garbage, okay. Talking garbage, that's fine. But rude garbage, not on my watch. I saw your help. Well, Gabe here thirsts for murder, and Babelford just had his house demolished, so I think there might be some aggression there. Sorry to hear about that. We're a wide neighborhood. It was up on Desperation Street. Oh, yeah. Good trash up there. Rise of the Refuse. What's in it for us if we deal with your trash problem? Oh, you'd be surprised what people throw away. I'll make sure you get your just reward. All right. Oh, James has something special waiting for you. I always do right by them that help. Hey, hello, trash. Blarg, blurgle. Blurg. Bah. Dialogue. Hey, I actually got first. I'm gonna wait. I see why James didn't want to do this. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's a no on you, buddy. I was trying to attack, actually, but hey. I was trying to select my attack, and I took that as me wanting to... Oh, wait, actually, I got this. Ha-ha! Wheat versus wait, what now? Oops. Oh, well. More than enough. Oh, okay. Interesting. So I got a new special. There we go. Something I didn't already have full up on. Awesome. Ah, crap. Is the hobo going to team up with the trash? Of course the hobo is going to team up with the trash. The hobo is on the trash's side. Oh, why did I speed myself up? Oh, well. Versus firearms, if I remember correctly. Okay, this isn't as bad as I remember because it seems to always be WASD. I've seen other games where it's completely randomized letters on the keyboard. Whoa, he's got one hit point left. Oh, there we go, no, he doesn't. Partial block, damn. And the combo didn't seem as effective. And it uses two people's attack. That'd be even cool. Yay! Block my butt. Alrighty. Oops. Go! Oh well. Trash dish. You know what? There's no point in waiting. Refill my supercharge. Ba -da -da -da. Alrighty. Seriously, this is just gonna be a bunch of fights. I may not bother. I may not bother slowing and you know, editing in between the speed ups. 
because, again, this is just going to be me fighting garbage and hobos. So I'm not going to cut it out. But I'm also not going to... More hobos this time. Why do they leave the other people passing by alone and fight me? How about yeah? There we go. Everybody's all fast and stuff. What is the point of one something that does one damage? Ha-ha! <laughs> <laughs> ah. Heck yeah! Heck yeah, I'm the full damage. Oh crap, that guy's buffed. I should probably be taking him out. There we go. He is this. Here we go. Oh, yeah, bravo. No point in charging up a full attack when he's about to die. Oh, actually, the bleeding would have killed him. I wasted it. Oh well. Don't you throw your breath, don't you? Oh, you're, you're, you're just punched. I guess hobos get in so many fights they develop punch immunity. Wow, I was really not paying attention there. Thankfully, I was on the ball in that moment. Punchy, 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 boom. Yay! Wham! Go big bong! There we go. Get ready for W A S D. W A S D. How about you know? It was W A S D. Let's see if this will do the trick. Finish him off, maybe. Just a little bit. There we go. Alright. Actually, I may... Is... I don't know. Do I really need to include just endless grinding? Or not endless, but you know what I mean. Because it's just one fight after another with nothing unique about it. Hello, what are you doing up there? Hey, garbage. Are those robots gonna jump down? Yep. The robots jump down to join the party. Dang, that was actually highly damaging. Oh, they weren't close enough together. Alright, one left. We'll take it out the old-fashioned way. With merciless beatings. Yeah. Merciless, clumsy, partial damage beatings. Alright. Boom. Partially confident beatings. Alrighty. Took that one out. What's that? Seems to give me the liquid armor more than anything else. I don't use that. Oh well. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and pause it, because, like I said before, the rest of it is just me hunting down battles. Alright. I just took out the trash. We managed the trash issue. Let's return and put our filthy friend at ease. All right, uh, and yes, I did it on purpose. Took out the trash. All right. Not only did I make that joke, I then called attention to it. Zero shame. All righty.
Hey, buddy, the living trash is no more. All right, the trash is piling up, people. I hope you got good news for me. Has this ever happened before? Angry garbage? Yeah, I don't think so. Seems like something you'd remember. Creatures are, could be a hermitops in their larval stage, but that sludge we collected earlier. Mere science cannot dis determ discern its deeper nature. It might have dark properties we can't begin to guess at, such as the power to arouse common objects into shambling on life. Seriously? Or seriously? God, I hope so. We dealt with the problem. I think we got it cleaned up. I owe you folks, too. I got something special for you. Oh boy, oh boy! A red plastic coin. A red to which bits of gristle still cling. Boardwalk currency. You're paying this in garbage? Yeah, it is in garbage. I mean, yeah, I found it in the garbage. It's a token for the boardwalk. Damn thing's practically money. I'm always finding great stuff in that trash. He produces a jar of what appears to be human teeth. And rattles it like a grizzly maraca. Uh, yeah, those are wow. That's it's always so you have some always have some teeth. Beauties, ain't they? You found teeth in the garbage? Yeah, how could I not? Have fun with your jar of teeth. Oh man, how could I not? Alrighty. Now we can head to the wharf. Although we still don't have a ticket. We have a gear, but not a ticket. I mean, a token, but not a ticket. So we can get a prize, but we can't get an entry. Slurry of carnival food and. Oh! Yes, yes, investigate the giant gear. Greta Swindle, reputable vendor, despite what you might have heard, or even directly experienced. Okay, hold on. Giant gear. All right, I, I got the token. What am I doing wrong? Sale. That's gotta be some kind of euphemism. What's we got for sale? Sixteen gear. Tiny Ferris wheel. Ornate looking horn. How much for the gear? You like it? It's an antique, an import. And put an antique from... From? Expensia! Things from there are costly, I'm afraid. What's it gonna cost us? One token! Just one? Yeah, I really don't like it. Roll that gear on out. Have fun with you, whatever this thing is. He rolls out your new acquisition differently, returning to his strange little nest. He then places the small cone in his thumb, flipping in the air, catches his mouth, begins to chew. And turn to my selection. Oh yeah, it's understandable. All right, now we go back to and clear. Right, right, mate. Whoa. All righty. did secure a rather large gear. Did you? And this gear is... It's down in the garage ready to be raised to the crane. You have a crane? She becomes a very picture of poise. Every young lady should have a crane. Our partnership has been incredibly productive. Hopefully this gear and vast key will bear fruit. But that'll uh, attract the fruit molester robots. And it, indeed, child's dark fruit. Yes, Uncle. Still the market for a place to live. I would... And my standards are getting progressively lower. I would... Lower. Progressively lower. At this point, I would settle for relatively few lizards. He weighs heavily on me mind. This place seems nice. Your family own another one? I'll ask when they return. I believe it will be next year. Is what we're doing actually useful? Is this stuff helping? Oh, yeah, of course. I apologize. I often live within me own head. I'll continue me studies, certainly, to those depths which science may penetrate, but I'm operating from a bloody theory. Break it down for me. Taken as a whole, the evidence produces... Blah, 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 stretching. 
The evidence presents an alarming assertion. The corruption of a mechanical construct with forces... Look, forces? Forces beyond natural science. Malevolent beings may roost, may roost in ordinary machines, indeed. There are many such cases, as I'm sure you know my thesis. Uh, uncle, so-called extranatural possession is not something I can determine with a test to. What's next? That bolt, the one wriggling with no human language, did leap out the... D uh, that bolt, the one wriggling with no human language, did leap out the window. And even now it rolls to some nefarious purpose. Could it be the small part hungers to be reunited with the whole? Were you able to ascertain its direction? Again, toward Obo Alley, I believe, and seismic data collaborates a possible rendezvous. As preposterous as that might appear. I don't know how much more I can just deter from bits and bobs. We need to attain a prototype, the beautiful hoe. Back to Hobo Alley. The seismic readings certainly piqued me interest. Pelican Bay may also turn up surprises if you have time. All right. Good hunting. Good wheel hunting. Okie dokie. Back the whole alley. Back and forth. Back and forth. I'm not even sure what I'm doing anymore. I'm just doing the same stuff. Hey, Mr. Jar of Teeth. You got anything new to say? Yeah, you're like a little song I'm working on. Song about trash. It's an orthodox topic. Maybe an untapped market for this kind of material? I don't know. You know, I don't know. You want to hear it? Run away as if chased by wolves. <laughs> Alrighty. There, look. Meat. Questionable meat. Oh man, we got meat for you. Me, I don't remember what voice I gave him. Crap. 